One of the most common problems that young brass players will have when it comes to playing on the mouthpiece is that the tone or pitch are inconsistent, that they waver quite a bit. This is caused by one of two things in most cases. One, inconsistency in the airflow, uh, meaning either that there is constriction somewhere uh, from the lungs through the throat out in the embouchure, um, or that there's just fluctuations back and forth in it. Uh, the second, op second possibility is that the embouchure itself is unstable. Um, so these uh, manifest themselves in a couple of different ways, and you can pretty quickly diagnose it by watching the student. The first thing is watch the jaw. Do you see a lot of movement in the jaw and in the lips as they play? That uh, inconsistency of foundation in the embouchure is going to create natural problems within that sound. Encourage the student um, to keep that sound consistent. Go back to your long tone exercises with um, an emphasis on consistent tone, consistent pitch. If they find that it's unstable, take the mouthpiece off and restart. If it's an air issue that's causing it to surge, um, you're going to hear not only the pitch change, but also the timbre change, the dynamic of that sound. This is caused by surging right now. I'm pushing and relaxing, pushing and relaxing in my abdominal muscles. Um, go back to breathing exercises like sizzling to encourage students to have consistency. Then transfer it to the mouthpiece. This ability to hear the inconsistency of tone and pitch is also a reason why the mouthpiece makes a great diagnostic tool um, as students are having problems on their instrument. So if you're a student who has instability on their instrument, have them play just on the mouthpiece to see if the pitch or tone are inconsistent there and address those problems as you move forward.